The goblin you just threw, Joe, takes his turn next. He gets to his feet, shakes his head, looks at the goblin next to him, and yells out, I kills you! Uses my mortal's enemy! And rolls a 13 to hit against the goblin next to him, which only nicks the goblin's armor. The goblin that was just attacked by your charmed gobbo attacks him back and get parried by his blade. Three goblins from the horde that just ran down the hall are going to be attacking Joe, Barack, and George with their short bows. The arrows miss Barack and George, but definitely hits Joe with a critical hit, dealing eight piercing damage to you as an arrow nails you right in your swinging arm. Don, it's your turn. I need to conserve my spell slots. I already burned two second level slots, so I'm just going to cast a firebolt down the hallway towards a hostile goblin. That's a 21 to hit for eight fire damage. You hit one of the goblins in its big dumb head and it goes down. In total, there are seven hostile goblins left down this hall. Droop, it is your turn. I use my bonus action to apply Hunter's Mark to another bad gobbo and shoot him. That's a 27 to hit for eight piercing damage and an additional one from Hunter's Mark. That one goes down as well with a thud. Six goblins remain and George, it is your turn. I'm gonna step forward, pushing up on the goblin and cast sleep at a first level. I wanna try and knock out as many goblins as I can especially the ones towards the back of the pack. I rolled a 21 for my sleep roll. The three goblins towards the back pass out, falling over and dropping their bows and start snoring. Two goblins towards the front who think their friends behind them are backing them up go to attack you, George. One shoot an arrow and the other slashes at you with its scimitar. While the scimitar hits your armor with a glancing blow, dealing no damage to you, the goblin's arrow sticks you in the arm, successfully dealing eight piercing damage to you. Barack, it's your turn. Same thing I always do. Hex and blast one of the goblins. Going to pick the one that shot the arrow that hurt George. That's a 19 to hit for 11 force damage and four necrotic from Hex for a total of 15 damage. I'm just gonna make this guy's head explode for daring to hurt my friend. 